Okay, so Apple released iOS 17.2 and it's packed with some amazing new features. There's a new app, there are new widgets, there are new settings that you really should turn on. In this video, I'm going to share with you my top seven new features in iOS 17.2 that you should know. Number one, and that is of course the new journal app. Journaling is actually something I wanted to do for a long time, but actually never had the time for it or the habit. Well, now in iOS 17.2, there's the new journal app. It's extremely powerful. It allows you to really create a habit of consistently creating a journal. And it's really useful because you can actually integrate everything from images to photos to voice notes or to even locations you have been. You can also lock your journals for example ask for a passcode immediately every time you're going to access the journal app let's set it up right there and you can basically let ios decide when you want to journal you can select specific days you'd like to journal and you get the notification then unfortunately it's not available on the ipad or the mac but it's just a matter of time till we see that number two are new widgets we now finally have this new clock app and we have new weather widgets so so let me briefly show you how they look. So let's edit the stack, hit the plus, then we go to weather. So this is the default one, this is the one we're used to see. But now you also get this one with more detail. Also this one, a smaller stack, but you can see the different days. And then this one when the sun sets and when the sun rises. And we have a new clock one which is this one. It's really nice. It's actually showing the seconds on the outside. You can also get this one on your Apple Watch. Three is that we can now finally change the default alert. So this has been one plenty of people have been asking for. So now if you go to settings and you go to your sounds and haptics, scroll down, you have this default alert section. When you click on that, you can see you can now add all these different new alert tones. So this is the new one that was added in iOS 17 and we couldn't change it well now you can change to your preference and what's also really cool is that you can now also change the default haptics so normally you have the synchronized one you just you can feel it but you can also make custom new vibrations so yeah it's really funny to make these you just tap the pad and you can just feel the different vibrations you stop it then you save it you can name it whatever you want let's call this test and now you can just add this as a custom alert haptic of course exclusive to the iPhones with the action button so in this case the iPhone 15 Pro models and that is that you can now add a translation option on your action button so let's do that together so if you go to settings and then we scroll to the action button as you can see here it's on silent mode and now if you scroll all the way to the right you see the new translate action button option and basically this allows you to just speak when you initiate it and you can can just select the different languages in the translate app and then we'll automatically translate it for you so that looks like this so let's try it out comment tu t'appelles so in French, output in English, but in the Translate app, you can actually change it however you'd like. A really useful feature for, let's say, if you're abroad and you don't speak the local language, you can just use this button all the time. I think it's a really awesome feature and also the animation is also pretty sick. Number five, and this is related to the Apple Vision Pro. So this is actually really a futuristic feature and that is that you can shoot in spatial video. Again, this is only exclusive to the pro models so to enable it we need to go to settings in settings we scroll down to camera right here and then we have to go to formats and in formats there's this new section here called video capture toggle this on you'll get this new apple vision pro spatial video icon in your camera so let's check that out we go to the camera app and you see it in the bottom left here there it is if you toggle it on you have to film landscape mode so we have to change that and then you can actually film anything in spatial video saying you need to move further away so this is specifically made for when you're maybe with family and friends so when there's more people involved if you watch this footage back it's just normal 1080p 30 frames per second footage nothing special but with the apple vision pro this should actually be really really amazing i'm really excited to try this out but right now we can only film it but not really experience it six is related to app 
Apple Music and that is now that we have a favorite songs playlist. I don't know what took Apple so long to introduce this, but what it basically does is that when you favorite any song, so let's try that out. So let's say we want to favorite this. It's going to be added to a new favorites playlist. So let's see if we can find it. Playlist and there it is. Favorite songs. It's a pretty small but the very welcoming new feature we've been waiting for for a while now. I think on Spotify this was there almost since the beginning. But now if you like any song it comes in your favorite songs playlist. Number seven is that in messages we now have the possibility to immediately react with stickers. On any message that looks like this when we go to messages have a look at me and my cute brother so in the past you couldn't really add stickers directly to any comment or any message now when you receive any message you just long press it and then you can just tap here on add sticker so let's do that and then you can just immediately add a sticker it's going to be put in the bottom left as you can see here so this is a pretty easy and quick one you should have been there from the start so you can see it's going to add the different stickers on the image in this case you can also do this of course to previous messages let's see how that looks a small welcoming new messages feature with stickers thanks for watching and see you in the next one peace